Hola, me llamo Juan, soy inglés y soy auxiliar de conversación aquí en Gijón, Asturias. Hoy voy a hablar un poquito en inglés sobre las ventajas de trabajar como un auxiliar de conversación aquí en España. So, first of all, um, I'm currently uh, studying uh, towards a, a Spanish degree in the UK. And so, um, I have to do uh, a year abroad in a Spanish-speaking country. And my university gave me the option of either studying at a partner university or working as a language assistant. I decided to become a language to work as a language assistant because um, in the future I'm considering becoming a teacher, and so I thought that it would be a good opportunity um, to see whether um, teaching is for me, to see whether um, I would like to become a teacher. And um, so far, it hasn't deterred me from wanting to become a teacher. So far, it's still something I want to do. Um, but also, even if you're not thinking about becoming a teacher, um, just the fact that you can say to employers, oh, I spent a year teaching English in Spain, is going to look quite impressive. So, um, f simply the experience is, uh, is is a very big bonus of uh, of working as an auxiliar de conversación, working as a language assistant. Uh, another advantage is uh, the working hours. Um, you're only expected to work uh, four days a week, uh, 12 hours a week. Um, so that leaves you a lot of time to not only explore Spain and explore some of the beautiful cities that Spain has, such as Sevilla, Salamanca, Madrid, Barcelona, uh, San Sebastián, etc. Um, but it also gives you a chance to really immerse yourself in the culture, um, so by going to different different um, Spanish festivals, uh, the local cuisine, and also it it's an opportunity for you to, even though you're teaching English for a year, it's also an opportunity for you to learn or uh, improve your Spanish. I mean, I'm studying a toward, I'm studying Spanish at university in the UK, but since I've been here, I have already learned a lot of uh, new Spanish words or new Spanish phrases. Um, so that's another advantage of working as a language system. And the final advantage which I'm going to talk about is probably um, one of the biggest ones for, for me personally. And that is um, there have been times when I've been at classes, when I've been in classes and I've taught the students um, a new word or a new uh, idiomatic expression. And... Uh, a few days later, the teacher then comes. The class teacher might come up to me in the staff room and, and show me a student's essay. And within that essay, the student has used that word or that idiomatic expression, and it makes you feel um, quite. It, it does make you feel really happy. Uh, it does make you feel. It makes you feel great that what you're teaching is positive. It is making a positive. Um, impact on the uh, student's learning. Um, but similarly, you're also expected to work as you, if you were the ambassador of your country. So in my case, I'm expected to work as if I was the British ambassador. Um, and so there have been classes where I've taught uh, the students about uh, British customs. So for example, wearing poppies in the month of November to remember all those who have fought for the country in wars. Um, I've also talked about British cuisine, so I've taught them about uh, the what a shepherd's pie is, what a cottage pie is, and I've also taught them about some festivals we might have that they may have never heard of, such as uh, maybe Burns Night, which commemorates a Scottish poet called uh, Robert Burns um, on the 25th of January. Um, and a lot of the cases, the the when I've talked about different customs, different traditions, different ways of British life, um, they're things maybe the students have never heard of before, and so they're very much they're very much interested in it. And just the look on their faces, uh, the look of interest on their faces as you teach, um, it does make you feel like you're doing a good job. Especially when after the lesson, the students might get up and start clapping. Um, and so those are the pretty much the three main big advantages of this job. Um, 
and uh, if I didn't have to go back to the UK to uh, to finish my degree, then I would more than happily stay for another year. But unfortunately, I have to go back to the UK. Um, and so I hope that you will enjoy the experience as much as I have. And uh, bueno, uh, adios y hasta muy pronto. Hello, my name is Sharice Saavedra and this is my third year as an auxiliar de conversación. Uh, my first year I was in La Rioja and this is my second year in Asturias. So I think that the program is amazing because you can learn so much. Uh, first of all, you can really improve your Spanish um, depending on your motivations for doing the program. You can immerse yourself as much as you want or you can travel a lot. Uh, another benefit is simply learning about the culture. Um, I love Spanish food, I love the people, um, I have visited lots of different places in Spain and it's very diverse so that's a wonderful thing. Uh, and in general you can meet a, one, a lot of wonderful people uh, from all over the world, not just Spain, but the other people who do the program are from all over, um, from the United Kingdom, from Australia, from New Zealand, from Canada, from everywhere. So you can meet a lot of people. Salut, bonjour à toutes et à tous, je m'appelle Benny, je suis canadien, euh, je travaille dans un lycée maintenant, il s'appelle la Université Laborale, et donc je voudrais vous parler un peu des trois raisons pourquoi vous, devrait être une auxiliaire de conversation. D'accord Vous êtes prête On y va La première raison. Vous aurez tellement de temps libre pour apprendre une nouvelle capacité, un nouveau don. Dans mon cas, j'ai appris le français, comme vous voyez, et l'espagnol aussi. La seconde raison. Vous allez avoir une opportunité pour connaître un pays extraordinaire. C'est quoi c'est à tout pays Je vous le jure que la culture espagnole est distincte de la tuya. Je vis ici en Asturias, et Asturias n'a rien à voir avec le Canada. Pero estoy a gusto. Me encanta la comunidad, la provincia donde vivo yo. Eh, reason number three. Uh, affordability, cost of living. You will be able to buy whatever it is that you're used to buying. Afford an apartment, go traveling, do interesting things, meet people, eat out, etc. Trust me. Don't hesitate. Apply today. 